Okay, let's try this again. All right, I got uh, the manifold right here mapped out. I've got orange, blue, green, and pink. And these are quick connects right here. So, you know, I really don't have to fool with this at all. I just want to take this off. I'll, uh, actually, I'll probably just drain it by pulling these two right here and then operate it some. I'll probably take it off and clean it inside and out. But the hoses are coming off. And as you can see, I got uh, pink. And this is the line for pink. And it runs down and crosses over. So the other cylinder on the far side over there is going to be pink on the end. And then it'll be orange at the top, which here's the orange in the back. All right. And then the blue is the top of the cylinder here and the top of the cylinder over there. And the green's the bottom and the green's the bottom. All right. Come back over here. See? Pink. We'll go for the back and then orange for the front up here. And then we got green and then we got blue, blue, and then green. It's just following the lines. Watch it where they're all going so I'll know where they go on it. Yeah, because I'm going to replace them all. I'm not even going to use this steel because, uh, well, I don't like it. I might use it. I don't know. It just depends uh, because there's only three here. There should be four, all right, but there's only three right here. I should have had another one like that one right there, that one right, this all right there. I changed all that, but I want it, I want them up here mounted on the top above it and then come down to the front over here see and then here in the middle and then the same on this side there's only two gonna be over here really i don't have to worry about it but <clears throat> I, i'm getting away from all them fittings being right there at the front and i have drained the oil on this thing you can see i took the high pressure side off on the pump and the same thing with the uh power steering and then I took the low pressure side off which there it is right there and I had a <laughs> spill it poured out all over I had that straight I was working on this side but I took the uh, I took the oil filter thing off right here the pipe and when I pulled this uh, footstep right here off it turned over sideways and turned over and just started dumping it out on the floor so I got to clean the floor but that's my second oil change hydraulic fluid and uh, it's uh, it's just full of water everything is full of water so I need cheaper uh, oil filters is what I need I need cheaper oil filters and I need cheaper hydraulic filters uh, the air filter I can get two of them for 40 bucks you know but if I buy the oil filter, the hydraulic filter, and one air filter, it's $100. Uh, I think that's a little expensive. There got to be some cheaper ones out there somewhere to fit this tractor. It's a 1710, 1984, with a 770A loader on it. Well, there you go, guys. Enjoy. Peace. I still got to take these loose right here because they're high so they're going to be full of water anything that uh, turns up is going to have water in it so uh the thing to do is i'll probably just take that the front pipe loose since i've already got the high pressure side off on the other side and i'll take the block apart right here and just let it all drain out and hopefully all I have to do is loosen that and letting it let it twist down. And that one I'm sort of scared of because it's got a uh, bad rust spot on the top of it. But luckily, it turns, turns, and then turns. So it's all going downhill. That bottom one though is uh, actually going uphill. So maybe I can fix it. But you can't really see it. Uh, I ain't got a light. I don't think. Here we go. You see that right there? And it's just eat up, and I ain't figured out what's eating it up, but something's eating it up.
side rush. <clears throat> and once I get the hydraulics fixed and everything, I'm gonna put brakes on it. They look like they'll be pretty easy to get to. You take and uh, pull the fenders off, and here's where the brakes go here and here. So shoes ought to be all right. There you go, guys. Peace, Nanny, Nanny, Shaw's bought, and all that other good shit. Bye.